Folks, Rooster here in Tennessee. Got another quick video to do for you. Piece of equipment that we're looking at today is a Palomar Elite 250. Uh, really simple piece of equipment, on and off switch, low, medium, and high, with automatic sideband delay, which means you're going to have a sideband delay every time. Uh, you can disable that from the inside, I'm pretty sure, if you don't like that. Uh, it's not that big of a deal, but to some people it is. We have a preamp. Preamp does work. If you can hear the static level come up on my radio. It does work. Uh, like I said, simple piece of equipment. This one's in pretty good shape. And we're going to see what it does today. The meter we're going to be using is our Bird 43P, as usual. Uh, the scale we'll be looking at, since we've got a 500 watt slug, is going to be 50 watts. So dead in the middle. The... Uh, the 50 watt mark will be 500 so you got the 100 watt uh, 100 watt scale at the bottom 500 up above it <clears throat> let's turn this thing on and for the sake of saving a little bit of time on our video we're going to do uh, readings on peak for low medium and high but for high we're just going to do average and we are starting out on average power so let's key her up and see what happens Dead can a little bit less than a hundred. Audio one. Hello, audio one, two, three. Audio one, audio one, two, three. 130, 140 watts there. Average power. We are running 14.5 volts on this thing, and our drive is about 35 to 40 watts of drive out of this Connex. Audio one two three. All audio audio one two three. Exactly two hundred and fifty watts almost. Hello one two three. About two forty on high. <clears throat> we'll go to low. Audio test one two three. Audio test one two three. Audio test one two three. Right at two hundred on low. Audio, this is medium. Audio, this is medium. Audio test. One, two, three. Let's see our difference in carrier. We'll start with low. Thirty-five watts. That's medium, about eighty watts. And that's high about 90 to 95 watts now what we're going to do uh, since I'm driving it with this high power radio and it's doing exactly 250 watts about 240 watts I'm going to unhook this radio and give you an idea what to do with the low power radio which as usual will be the uh, Cobra 148 so let me pause this video come back with the Cobra 148 if you're not interested in what it does with the 148 then you can stop watching the video right now because uh, the remainder of the video is just going to be using the Cobra. Okay, we'll be back. Thanks. Okay, here we are. We're back. Cobra 148 does 10 to 12 watts. You guys have seen it a few times if you watched any of my videos. And still with the Palomar 250, both running on 14.5 volts. Our peak kit is on. I've already got it turned on. So let's see what she'll do. They can over 100 watts. The 148 key is a little bit higher than the Connex does. Audio test, one, two, three. Audio test, one, two, three. 200 on high. Audio, one, two, three. Audio test, one, two, three. 140 on low. Audio test, one, two, three. Audio test, one, two, three. 190 on high. There you go, folks. That's it. Palomar Elite 250 does about 50 watts less um, with about 20 watts less going into it. So not a bad trade-off. Uh, does great with the low-power radio. Does good with a high-power radio, but uh, for wattage in versus wattage out, this uh, 148 is doing the job for it. I hope you guys enjoy. 
If you got any questions, let me know. 73s, blah, blah, blah.